it seems simple. What is the purpose of a corporation? Um, up until very recently, the idea was let's make money. Uh, since 1997, the Business Roundtable, which is an association of the CEOs of about 200 of America's largest companies, endorsed a shareholder primacy model, which is to say that sh corporations exist to serve shareholders and to make money for their shareholders. Uh, all of that changed in August of uh, 2019 when the Business Roundtable reversed course and 181 CEOs signed a statement uh, endorsing a, uh, a stakeholder governance model. There's about 300 words in the Business Roundtable statement. The word shareholder doesn't appear until the 250th word. Uh, I assume they're sending a message. Uh, uh, no, I, I don't think that they were trying to send a message that shareholders are not important. Obviously, shareholders are extremely important and pro probably still maybe the most important, but um, I mean, that statement was uh, you know, made in response to several different things. I think one is, is what Mary said with the uh, recognition of how most companies, most of those CEOs, or probably all of them who signed it, are already running their business in that manner to take into account all, um, all of the various things that affect long-term shareholder value. I mean, that's, that's really what it's all about. It's about creating long-term value. When we engage with shareholders, they want to know about ESG. They want to know about human capital management. The, the whole concept of taking into account all stakeholders has to do with long-term value and not necessarily short-term profits. Shareholders vote. <laughs> and I think that's a key. And I think if you... Uh, Ask, I, I agree with Kelly in that the shareholder still is the primary uh, focus and responsibility for a member, for a board, and for management. And it's been in the last three or four years that I think we've seen a lot more attention given to all of the stakeholders, not just the shareholders. And I think that um, when you look at proxy statements, you look at 10Ks you'll see information that had never been provided before. You'll see charts that show the diversity not only um, among the board, but also reference links to websites that show the diversity of the workforce. You'll show, uh, being in energy, you'll uh, um, go to the websites and you'll see a sustainability link now that was never there before and it'll talk about all of these things you know the environmental impact your company has climate change and as um, I think Valerie said in the earlier one whether you agree with it or believe it or not it's something that our investors are interested in and want to hear about.